Hello again. Welcome back to this series of videos that we are creating showing you how to leverage Moodle's quiz module. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add section to your quiz or to your exam using Moodle. For those who are joining us for the first time, I'm using a Moodle site that is running on the Snap theme. So your settings may be in a slightly different location, but I'm sure the principles will still be the same. So I'll click on the gear icon to the top right and I'll click on edit quiz. Once the edit quiz screen has loaded, I will add some questions to the quiz. I'll click on add and have the option to create a new question or I can add from a question bank or I can add a random question. In this case, I'm going to add from a question bank. I'll choose the question bank or the category from which I'm going to get my questions. I'll choose multiple choice here. Then I'll select the questions that I want to add. I'll select three and add selected questions to the quiz. Once this is done, I will add a few more questions from a different question bank. I'll choose the question bank that I want. For now, I'll use percentage answer weights. I'll select two questions from this bank and add questions to the quiz. You'll notice that the last questions that I added are at the bottom. So I want to create sections here. So in order for, for me to be able to add sections, there are two things that I must do. Number one, I should create the first section heading. Then number two, I should add another page because you can only have sections when you have multiple pages. So let me create the first section. I'll click on this little pencil icon. Then I'll name my section, section A. We'll even um, add multiple choice. And I'll click enter once I'm done. In order for me to add another page, what I can do is to come and click on this little icon that will add a page break. And notice I'm adding it just between number three and number four. If you remember, number three was the last question from the multiple choice questions and number four was the first question from the percentage answer weights question bank. So I'll click on that little icon and that creates a page break. And once this is done, when I come and click add here to the right, I have a new option, add a new section heading and I'll do that. Once I've done so, I can click on the pencil icon to rename my section and I'll call this section B. Let me just call it short answer. You can always call it whatever you want. Then I'll press enter. And there you go. You're done with entering your sections. You can always add more sections if you wanted to. And the questions will be delivered in those sections. Let's see how this will look for the students who will be taking this quiz. Now I'm in this quiz as a student. This is a preview. You'll notice that in this particular theme that I'm using, the snap theme, the section heading is not displayed up here at the top. But if I scroll down to the bottom, you can see at the bottom where we have the quiz navigation, section A has those questions, then section B has those questions. So a student can be able to click on any of these to navigate to the different questions. So that is how you add sections to your quiz or your exam on Moodle. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions that you would like me to address, please leave them in the comments below this video. And please like and uh, share this video to other lecturers that might benefit from the information that was presented herein. I hope you'll enjoy what remains of your day. Be blessed.